I'm going to show you how I post a helpful educational tweet. The first step is to post a helpful title and description communicating the value of the resource you're sharing. This just helps people save time, helps them determine whether this is a tweet I want to look at or one that I'm not interested in. In this case, I'm looking at the TED-Ed Talk Math Class Needs a Makeover. And I can actually use that title because I think it's pretty good. In this case, I put TED Talk in square brackets, math class needs a makeover, essential math strategies that help students to stop and think. The second thing I need is to post a shortened link. Most URLs are very long and they need to be shortened and a tool called tinyurl or bit.ly will work just fine. So what I do is I click on this address. I'm going to right click and copy. I typed tiny URL in Google and this page came up. I'm going to paste this in here. So I'm going to press control V and then I'm going to type in UOIT. I think math strat. Then I click make tiny URL. There's the link that I want. So I'm going to take it, press control C, come back here and press control V. And there's my link. The next thing I need is a picture. A tweet without a picture essentially is never looked at. There's several tools that can help you grab a snapshot of a picture that you'd like. I use Snippet, which comes with Microsoft products, or you can use Jing, and that's free as well. So my picture is going to be this one. So I'm going to launch Snippet, and there it is. It's pretty easy. I'm going to click on New. And then I just simply see the crosshair there. I'm just going to drag over here and I have my picture. Next, I'm going to save it. So file, save as, and then I'll click save over here. And then I'm going to have to pick hashtags. Teacher tips and teacher training are very good hashtags. But if you want to expand your hashtag vocabulary, I suggest best 100 education hashtags at this URL. So now we're ready to post our tweet. Click on tweet, copy and paste my title in there. Then I'm going to click on add photos. Here's the math post photo. I want to paste my link in here. So there's my link. Finally, I want to put in my hashtags. So now I'm ready to click on tweet. 